What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idle Heroes, and today, well, we need to get going on this event, because there's a little bit of a secret thing we're going to be testing out later today, a fix that got added to the game, but in order for me to test it out, we need to get some stuff done in this event. So what we're going to do is uh, we've already purchased the entire relay, so we do have a decent stockpile of these contract starry gems and these regular starry gems. Um, we need to get... Our soul awakenings done that's going to be our priority number one and now there is one issue here hold on <laughs> hold on wait a minute um we don't really have bag space whatsoever we just have all these four stars and everything um um <laughs> well let's hope we have some stuff already ready to be summoned out otherwise we're gonna have to do a couple things first um which I really don't think we do have things to do. I do want to summon for as many Ilamok as possible. Don't know if they're in this chest. They're not. Oh, oh I don't think we really have like any Ilamoks to summon for at all. We'll have Vulcans and things like that. I really want to hit a good Ilamok copy though. Uh, but we want to be able to rege not regenerate. We want to like regurgitate these. Oh, man. <laughs> Oh, this is not good. Honestly, though, we probably have some stuff. We got even a free awakening here, and yeah, we can just get rid of all of this stuff, right? Right? We don't we don't need any of these. No, no, we don't. Wait, did we want to build another Isla Mock? Oh no, we did. Oh, I just destroyed some of them. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I don't think Isla Mock has even hit. Uh, the new shard pool up here, have they? Where's the fortress? No, it looks like Holmes Young is the newest one. Gosh darn it. Oh, I'm so stupid. Because, <sighs> of course, what we want to do eventually is we want to build up his tenant spots better. And right now we have a Saya, which is an assassin. We want a warrior in there. I'm an idiot. I'm just so stupid. Whatever. We can awaken a lot of Vulcan copies here this week, though. Um, yeah, is what it is. One thing we're going to have to get done right away, and this is going to be part of our other video, is we need to just... If we just use all these up, this should do us pretty well. Uh, where's our freaking non-elites? There they are. <laughs> we need to get this done just so that we have some bag space, and then I can literally just trash the rest of the four stars and make sure we have some bag space. I just want to make sure I don't make the mistake and destroy all these and then just be sitting there like, well, now I need to reacquire all these things from the bag once again, because as you guys know, on an account like this, food just does not matter at this point. We have a ridiculous amount of food that we're never going to need to use. Uh, yeah. So we grabbed all those. Now we can literally just come over here and quick disassemble all four stars. Yay. Okay, we have backspace now. So let's go to our chest real quick here. Uh, if we can grab better copies out of here, we will. We'll grab like a Vulcan copy out of here because, of course, Vulcans are still that big prime good value stuff. Um, and we'll grab Mockman out of these chests. We'll do Mockmans. We'll do you. It's really no one I want to use these chests on right now. I guess what we'll do is come over to these. Vesa? Yeah, I guess we'll grab Vesa copies out. That should be good for right now. That should give us a decent amount of copies to go off of. We got some Mockman. Uh, maybe another one? Nope, it's an Aspen. That's fine. Uh, now that Vesa's in these shards, I actually do want to open them up. Yep, we hit three vessels right there, which is really cool for us. Uh, we got a lot of vessels there as well. And what we can do is we can open these up and 113 of them. We might get a few vessels, I'd say. Um, but, 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 wait. <laughs> wait, what? There we go. We got one vessel out of 117. Good Lord. All right. Anyway, let's go to the five stars. Let's get this going. We want to get all the way up to 200 points and get that guaranteed B that I want to use on an Isla Mott copy to see if we can high roll an A tier. That would be amazing. Um, man, we got a lot of heroes just locked down at 100 for the old star expedition we used to do. <laughs> I'm praying. I'm praying. I saw Rex got literally like two S tier rolls on Amazon servers or something like that. I'm like, I'm just so jealous, man. How is it? 
how is it that we've yet to hit an A tier on our own accounts? We've gotten very close. We've hit multiple B plus heroes, but we've never hit an A minus or higher live ourselves. And even for a viewer is this crazy thing. Just absolutely nuts. Um, we'll go with some Aspen copies. Aspen is a good hero to awaken. We need to do at least like 30 something of these to get all of the rewards we want this week which should be pretty good. Uh, let's keep going. Let's keep going, let's keep going. I think we might come away with a couple sublimation chests this week as well, which is kind of good uh, because there are some tree branches on Isla Mok I want to awaken and should really help him out. I don't think we're gonna go for a core of origin on him just yet. It is a pretty cool core, but I just don't think we have a use for it right now. But we'll see. We might do it. We might. Just depends if we go all in on this event or not. Stupid rainbow of a D there. Not great. Let's go back over and do Vesa copies. Because Vesa's value is actually held very, very well. It's amazing that her value is held so long. And she was like one of the original, what, like four Transcendence heroes? Which is just nuts. Maybe five. Was it five? We had... Maybe she was the fifth one. I can't remember. I don't. I can't remember if Lord of Fear Aspen came out before or after her. I feel like it was before, and I feel like she was number five. Can't really remember at this point. Anyway, let's just keep awakening these heroes here. Can we hit anything lucky? We're going to again try not to touch any of our regular starry gem if we can afford to. Uh, that's like a refund copy, which is at least decent. I'm hoping next time we get the Soul Awakening session, we get the retirement event again. That retirement event we had in like January was just absolutely amazing. One of the best things they've ever done in the game, especially for like free to play accounts because it made it so much more, I guess it was, it just made it so much easier to acquire what you needed and get resources in that event. Like it was just so, so simple. All right, four more and then we will do some destruction. And uh, and see where we're at as far as points go. I think we've done about like 15 to 16 ish so far, somewhere in that ballpark. So we're probably halfway there to the 200 point mark. Okay, come on, come on. Give us what we need. We need some good stuff here, man. We should be able to get, I think, one Islamot copy from this event which will be the one that we save and use the B on because right now our B minus copy is just really, really bad. Uh, is this gonna be good? Absolutely not. So we can go through and we can trash a bunch of copies. Another weird rainbow one here. Um, let's destroy all these. I kinda wanna hold on to the Vulcan though because I might need to build another Vulcan. But we'll recoup some resources, which is good and we'll destroy all these. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, before I forget, Let's just go through. I'm going to lock down. Well, actually, you know what I can do? Oh, I guess that's actually a worse copy. Nah, never mind. We don't need it. We already built our other Vulcan. Uh, Isla Mock. That's what I want to do. I want to go find our Isla Mock copy, which is... Where are you? There you are. I'm just going to lock it down just so I don't trash another one because... Oh, I can't believe I did that. Can't believe I did it. Okay, so yeah, we are up to about the 100 point mark. I want more of these guys. Uh, we're gonna have a lot of stuff to claim out here. We need to get to 200 and we're halfway there, yep. So we'll claim what we got so far. We'll claim all these chests so far and then we'll come back in here and we'll grab more hero copies. We'll get more Aspens just for some variety and uh, grab another Mockman copy. We got more dark heroes that we can summon for as well. Get you out, get you out. Did they update these too? No, man, they should have dropped some heroes off of this one. But I guess they are all like considered elite, so I guess it is what it is. Get that Mockman copy. This is the one that would be really good if we could please hit an A tier. Absolutely not. Literally the exact opposite of an S tier. Like the worst of the worst. Let's go back to Aspen copies for a bit and then we'll finish up with Vessas. If we need to, we're going to have to keep recycling these heroes, though. And I'm hoping we get some better rolls because otherwise we are going to have to dip into our regular Starry Gems. Oh, 
which I hate doing. Although we might spend, we might spend a little bit more this week, probably just getting more starry gems. But we'll have to see. Uh, at least it's the refund. We haven't hit a single B tier, which is amazing. Usually we've hit like a couple of them at least, but these are just being really stubbornly bad. I'll take C's though. Ooh. Okay, I still C. <laughs> I'll take the C's though, because at least they're either refunds or refund plus extra starry gems, contract starry gems, which means we can keep, you know, retiring and keep summoning for more again without touching our stockpile. Because I do want to save these back up again and try to get another good hero eventually, like potentially an A minus Isla Mach. I don't know how good that is, but like at least it'll potentially be good for some cool testing stuff. We'll have to see. Uh, back up to 445, not too bad. We got what? One or two more Aspen? One more Aspen, and then we go back to the Vesa copies. Oh, we need some good ones. Honestly, just give us some bees or something like that. I'll take them, please. Pretty please. Uh, no more Vulcans to awaken, which sucks. But uh, I guess we could buy them with relics. I kind of want to keep the relics, though. This is uh, another rainbow copy. Come on. You could at least be a C tier. Ah, man, this is a struggle here today. This is just not a good event. Not, not at all. Nope, nope, nope. This is a big rip for us. I mean, at least we're going to get a guaranteed B out of this at the end, which might be something really cool. Although I don't even think the chest we got had an Isla Mach in it. <laughs> we'll have to see though. One more and then we'll see where we are on this event. Please be at like 200. I really don't think we are, but we did hit a lot of like, like C tiers and stuff, which are like double the points and, oh man. All right, so let's claim out more of these chests. That means we only got like 60 more points, maybe even less. Oh, 171. Come on, man. Uh, we are gonna take the essence sublimation chest as always. And lastly, we need 30 or 29 more points. Well, we got to do it. We got to do it. We'll do a couple and re then retire just so we don't go too deep into the starry gems. But again, like I said, we're probably going to buy a few more starry gems here in a little bit. So we needed, what, 29 more points. That's only four, right? So we're down to 25 more points we need. Ugh, this is going to be brutal. This is gonna be brutal. That brings us down to like 20 points. Uh, <laughs> and the worst part is they don't even retire for much of anything. We can't even get a summon back off of those. Like, they're just so garbage right now. Please, oh, D plus, it's close. It's close. We're gonna just do this to get the extra 100. Oh man, we need, we need literally like an S tier and that'll finish out our event. Right here, S tier Vesa, we got it, no. No, 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 no. This is this is bad, okay? <laughs> 191. Ah. Uh, no, not Tusi Lago. Get out of here with that nonsense. Um I guess we do have some hero copies we could awaken. We got one Vulcan here. Sure, you know what? I'm going to do the Vulcan. If we're going to have to go into starry gems, might as well do it on like really good hero copies. <sighs> nope. Um Mockman, we got a couple Mockman in here. Sure, we'll do a couple more, maybe. I mean, if we hit like another A tier, that would be pretty awesome having double A tier Mockman. <laughs> we'll do this one over here. We're not gonna be able to recycle these at this point, sadly though. But they are the better hero copies. No, that's not working out good. What does that put us at point wise? We are at 209, that did it. I probably did one too many, but we got the B Awakening Stone. So how we're gonna end this right here is Where's the newest chest? The newest chest, I think, from this should have... Wait, does it not actually have Isla Mach in it? Really? Are you kidding me? Oh, no. I guess we're going to save it then. They need an Isla Mach copy. And I don't have any. And I don't think there's any way to get him. Although, can you even get him in here yet? No. Ah, oh, shoot. 
There's legitimately no way for me to get my hands on an Islamoc copy right now. Is there? Is there? Nope, no. Nope. Like, not anything right now has an Islamoc copy. Not a single thing has Islamoc in it. Is there? Oh, no, we can't buy a copy up here either, can we? <sighs> All right, well, I guess we just sit on that B-stone. I really wanted to use it. The game is taunting me, but... The play is to wait. So that was our really, really crappy run right there. We ended up doing how many? 13 or 21, 27, 28, 29, 34, 35, 36, 37. That was actually pretty much on par. 36 to 37 is normally what it takes. So is what it is. Hopefully you guys enjoy this one. I'll see you guys next time.